getting up here is like acoustic guitars and couches and just writing songs and going out to bars and kind of playing, at the time, like crappy songs for nobody. I mean, there'd be like two people at our show. There'd be like you and you and maybe a little mask guy. Show of hands or show of screams. Remembers a phase of music called emo music. Oh. I think. I, well, hold on. If you don't. Hold on one second. Perfect, right? You bust out that digital camera. And you hold it as high up in the sky as humanly possible. You know what I'm talking about? Way up there. And you take, how many pictures would you take? 5,000. That's exactly right. Who said 5,000? You win. 5,000. Well, once you've taken your 5,000 photos and you've selected the perfect one, this next part's really important because it dictates the future to I need to know, once you've selected the perfect one, where are you going to upload it to? Alright, on the count of three, you say where you upload it to, okay? One, two, three. My book is what I heard, but what I think we heard that was important was MySpace. And if you said MySpace, Tom would be so proud of you. And if you didn't say MySpace, I don't have a drink for you. But I will say that when I met Nash like seven years ago, emo music was huge. And we had a few things in common. One of them was that we didn't love emo music. The second was songwriting. The third was that we really didn't even like each other. That's a true story. It was not a bromance. Or again, it was not a bromance. But we got past it. And here we are today. And if it's alright with you, I'd like to play the very first song we ever wrote together for you guys tonight. That you will crowd participate like you've never crowd participated before. Do you promise that you pay close attention to the lyrics? Yeah. Alright, well, I'm gonna hold you to it. Would mean you would like me more That's why I wish that I could read it there With some 
Oh, <laughs> 